Hello, hello there. How is everyone doing today? I hope you're all doing fantastic. <sighs> Let's get started here. Why? Oh, my camera was turned off in the last stream. That's why it's not being shown here. But in the near future, um, camera will always be turned off. There we go. Yeah. Um, so I'm uh, preparing for my VTuber debut. I'm very excited for that. Uh, the stream for that will be on the 27th is what I've decided. So yeah. Okay. Where should we head first? Probably north. Let's go to this one here. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> it's a little bit annoying that they go to a trot in a town, like... I know it kind of makes sense. Mushroom. Do I have a picture of this? Uh, capture. Save. Add it. Okay. Uh, and then now... We go to album and... Delete this. <laughs> Anything special with this? Nah, I don't think so. Why are you standing over here? Gotta check everyone out. Princess? Really? Are you serious? The princess of Hyrule Castle who got swallowed up by the Great Calamity. That's the only reason we got peace here now. We really owe that princess. Okay. I gotta get a lot of bundles of firewood for that house. Um, side quests. Um, ancient materials. Okay. 3,000 rupees and 30 bundles of wood. No, that's not what I'm wanting to do. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Come on. Okay. I like that they automatically follow the paths. It makes it so much nicer. Oh, rip. I wasn't paying attention. Drive by, pick those things up, and let's go. Um, this way. Uh, yes, this is the correct way to go.
That's a bombable spot. Oh! Hi there. Can't carry any more of those. Amber, nice. It's raining. It most certainly is. How astute of you. That's a very big rock there. see a chest over there. I want it. That one's a bit tired. to do some major damage. Why do you stand up after a sneak strike? It makes no sense. Nice. All sneaky took out that group. Some arrows, very nice. Definitely need those. <laughs> Opal. Nice. Uh, how's my bow doing? It seems to be doing fine right now. But yeah, as I was saying earlier, um, my teaser reveal is going really well. I, I, I'm very happy with it, uh, for today, and yeah, uh, I'm excited for the actual, uh, debut stream, which is on the 27th. Um, I am... Currently a little bit indecisive of what to do exactly. I have a Twitter poll for it, but it's like, um, mornings are the worst. Big agree. <laughs> I'm thinking like either more Breath of the Wild, uh, playing like the first half of Dredge, uh, or doing like a variety of things, like play a little bit of Slay the Spire, play a little bit of Peglin, play a little of Wild Frost, and play a little bit of uh, Super Auto Pets. A little bit indecisive. Uh, and any of the above are going to be like a really fun time. So I, I'm not upset any way that that poll turns out. But um, uh, hey, where are, you, where are you going? Why'd you straight off the bat? Yeah. 
Hi, choo choos. Oh, I'll get the bird meat. Put on bum. Yeah. I did not hit the bird, so I wasn't able to get the bird meat. Unfortunate. <laughs> no! <sighs> Beetle, hi there. So Sorry, Beetle. The horse has a mind of its own. One thing I've noticed is that in most Zelda games, yeah. the um, monsters would drop rupees, but not in this game. Huh. They just drop like monster droppings and stuff. Oh, fuck. Yep. They just drop like the monster droppings. Nah, I'm good. You can, like, use those monster droppings to make potions and stuff. Is that a person? No, oh, that's... Um, okay, this is Korok, I think. Hmm. This must be a Korok, right? Korok. Yeah, you found me. Bye bye. Okay, bye bye. Almost hit the head against the rock. <laughs> Much easier. Okay. Lost a little bit of health. Should probably get some food. Um. Seared steak? We'll do a roasted acorn. And we'll probably call that good for now. Nah. <laughs> it's just gonna keep happening. Okay. Um. I think we'll cross this bridge and then just cut across the landscape because otherwise it's a huge detour.
Well, there's a rock in a hole. Every time you see something a little bit weird, it's like, that's probably Korok. <laughs> Big one. Okay, this is kind of a cool spot. I'm gonna take a detour. Oh, flower. Hello there. Another Korok. No. Oh. Um, do I have a picture of this? I like these little flower catch things. Bye bye. Okay. Uh, I might have that one marked. I do have that one marked. Yeah. Oh, hello, little birdie. I might as well head over here because, you know, it's a bit weird to have just these three trees next to each other. What are you? Huh. Interesting. Hello, Choo Choo. like a destroyed village down here. Huh. Well, I'm gonna go meet back up with my horse. I wish stamina recovery was better. I know there's like food stuff for it, but just in general, a little bit faster, you know? Like maybe as stamina amount increases, maybe it can recover a little faster as well. Like the, maybe the time from like empty to full is the same. But it's, uh, you know, a much bigger bar then, right? We'll do this shrine on the way. And let's talk with this dude. The end is here? I may be somewhat used to seeing bad omens by now, but that, well, let's just say it's better than most. We're doomed. I mean, don't panic. Sorry, who are you? Have we met? Well, it doesn't matter who you are, really. I was getting tired of talking to myself, so you've come at a good time. Uh, by the by, those strange things that popped out of the ground... Did you see them? Yeah. The About mushrooms here. Talked about those towers. They seem to have popped up all over the place. Yeah? 
And that's not the only strange thing that happened. The long deserted shrine suddenly started gr glowing. Uh, you know what this means, don't you? The end is here. With all this craziness happening, I've been keeping an eye on that thing. Just to see if it suddenly starts moving, you know? What thing? Talking about that guardian, of course. Haven't you heard the old stories about Hyrule? See that thing over there? The one shaped like an overturned urn? That is what I'm talking about. Did you know that some of them can move? One of them once chased me down and tried to kill me. This one here? No, it was a different one. That one was closer to the castle, but before the forest. When they spot you, they shoot blue beams of light at you. Man, I was so sure that was the end for me. I was prepared for the worst. But I somehow managed to escape into the nearby woods. I forgot to pick up the shield at the last place. You think it was my lightning fast reflexes that saved me? <sighs> I wish. Truth is, I just got lucky. Anyways, I hear guardians like that still wander around Hyrule Castle. Be careful. Okay. Well, now I have to see if that one is still alive, right? Out. I cannot swim all the way over there. I am not fast enough. Okay. Boshkala Shrine. Delete stamp. Unlocked the shrine. Head down into the shrine. Mm-hmm. The wind guides you. Bashkala Shrine. Okay, so teaching you about the wind mechanics. Amber. Nice. Always happy for more money. It's interesting it doesn't just give you rupees. It's like, yes, you get the amber, which... Maybe as a crafting material? Mm. I know the end goal is to fly, but... What's with these other sets of stairs, you know? Oh, okay, that's the way back. Nope. Okay, gotta get over further. Also, I'm definitely getting more stamina next. Like, having one more heart gives me a little bit more breathing room, but... That's disappointing. Mm, two and a half. I have a food for that, I think. I have three.
Yeah, uh, one and a half. That that's decent enough. No. Nope. Well, that just happened. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna get something to eat now. <laughs> uh, how about something that is three, like this? Hmm. Mm. Okay. Well, that was close. Closer than it needs to be. Please? Okay. Soldier's Claymore. Uh, that is 20. Uh, I can probably drop one of these for the claymore. Like, the spear is nice, but the claymore is really nice, you know? It is a two-handed weapon, so I can't use the shield when I'm using the claymore. resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. I bestow upon you this spirit orb. Spirit orb? Up to four, so we can get more stamina now. May the goddess smile upon you. Oh, yeah, we have done 12 shrines, haven't we? Good amount of progress. Ba, 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 da, da, da. Hmm. Or deposit. So we can track for these now. Eightfold blade is badly damaged. Some rock salt. Okay. Wait, what's that? Amber. Must have blown up from that rock up there. Okay. So we are once again heading across the landscape instead of taking the road, just because it will be significantly faster to do so. <laughs> Hmm. Uh, 
I see a mineral I want here. Not mineral, a thing. Yep, Zelda. Hi, they're cloudy. How you doing? Ow. Up, oh, and then switch to the other one. Um, we'll take the spear for now. Doing good. Just ate half your lunch and spent the last day programming. Nice. Anything interesting that you've been working on? Like per personal project work or um, work work stuff? Come on. Oh, geez. You are speedy quick. A Boku Shield. Personal project, a tool to check your account labels on Blue Sky. Ooh, interesting. I'm like interested in Blue Sky to a certain degree, but then at the same time, like there's already been some like weird things happening with Blue Sky, so I don't know how I feel about it. Probably better than Twitter, to be honest, but. Ooh, frog! Fuck, 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 fuck. No! Ugh. Reacted too slowly to frog. But maybe under this rock. A, a single green rupee. Excellent. Okay. Um. Let's just run up to this spot here. Have been exaggerating. And it will be fully open federated service soon. Cool. Okay. Yeah, I will probably get an account there then. Wait, why did I tag this spot? Did I see that and accidentally tag over here? Must be. Is this a stable? I think this is a stable. Yeah. Cool. Where's the front door? <laughs> Board horse? Never mind. Okay. So this kind of helps transport the horses between the different areas. Can't carry any more shields. Um, I think a pot lid is worse than a Boku shield, if I remember correctly. Oh, 
Oh, hey there, dude. It's been a little bit. Shalaka. So we meet again. Want to go home to Korok Forest, but I've lost my way. According to the folk at the stable, this area is central Hyrule. That means Korok Forest is still much further north. I may as well stay a while and relax. Wait a minute. I know that smell anywhere. It's a Korok seed. You've collected a Korok seed from the forest children, haven't you? If you give me Korok seeds, I'll expand one of your stashes. Uh, which one will it be? Um, I think it's always weapon. Um, you know, I should do one shield stash. Had to switch to desktop. Rough. <laughs> um, I think it's one shield stash. It's invite only. Yeah. Definitely. So I can grab that pot lid over there. Da na 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 na. <laughs> uh, probably weapon stash. Three Korok seeds. <laughs> like giving uh they did some good things like giving a black woman a bunch of codes to invite other people of color uh because they recognize the value of having them there yeah because otherwise it would just sort of become like really echo cham chamber -y, you know <laughs> uh let's do one more shield stash I don't use the bow enough that's like, oh yeah, I need more bows, you know? I want more shields specifically for fighting guardians. Um... Five Korok seeds. I'll, I'll do another one of these. <laughs> kind of put off a lot of... Uh, Mastodon kind of put off a lot of black people from joining. Initial audience wasn't very receptive. Was asking them to content warning, racism, etc. Yeah. But they seem more optimistic about Blue Sky. Yeah, so it'll be good for having it be part of like the federated instances to make it so that like people already on like you know the tech places like that that will be um like you know uh, like the tech places and the lgbt places and stuff those posts can still be brought over and like shared on blue sky then but blue sky could be like an easy entry for the masses excuse me an easy entry for the masses to be able to join in and stuff Make it so federated instances are actually like a potential thing to do, you know? How sad. Well, I'm out of Korok seeds, so there's not much I can do, bro. Why do I have... Hmm. Federated instances... So... Are federated instances different than like Mastodon stuff? Because I thought the uh, I, this might be my misunderstanding of it, but I thought federated instances and Mastodon stuff were like synonymous for each other. Was I wrong in that? Because my understanding up to this point was that they were the, like synonymous terms. Just Mastodon was like the official site in the original code base. Um, did I say official site? I meant original site. Um, 
Yeah. <laughs> Weapon bonuses. I see you up there. Wago Kata. In the name of Goddess Hylia, I offer this trial. Metal connections. Okay. So these are metal climbable blocks. So we're going to be using this to move those around. Okay. Activity pub as their underlying protocol, which is a protocol with with Federation. Blue Sky uses AT Proto, which is also a protocol with Federation, but they'll be their own networks. Interesting. Okay. So... <laughs> Federation does not mean Mastodon protocol, but it is a way to have multiple different websites connect together. Interesting. Okay. Good to know. Too far away. Good enough. Okay. Okay. So I have this now. So then... put this like here-ish? Something like that. Uh, both protocols have their advantages and trade-offs and they have different design goals. Activity Pub is more like email, whereas AT Proto is more like websites. Okay. Uh, and let's see, Activity Pub. Okay, Activity Pub is the Mastodon one, and AT Proto is the website one. Okay. I mean, Activity Pub felt pretty website y to me. Like, yeah, I can definitely see how it's sort of like email. But. I don't know, maybe, maybe like, maybe I'm not technical or I'm just viewing it more from a consumer standpoint than like the, like, engineer standpoint. Yeah, good enough. <laughs> Basic comparison, okay. <laughs> Activity Pub is sort of inboxy, right? May the goddess smile upon you.
inboxy is a good way to put it. Yeah. Um, like, Mastodon has a way of, like, moving accounts. But it's, oh, but the terminology is forwarding. So, like, you, the, the account gets moved over, but then people, when they send stuff to the old account or look up your old account, it forwards them to the new account. So I, I can see, like, the email-ish terminology there. Hold on. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> uh, that fence just popping in and out. It's like a redirect, yeah. Okay. Um... We're going to cross this bridge here and then go this way. Bottomless swamp. Uh, you went too far. Nah, random nerd stuff is good. I'm a random nerd, you know? <laughs> Uh, this is probably the clan. I, I I forget. Forget their name. Yeah, traveler. Excuse me, young traveler. But if I may be so bold, you look quite troubled. Perhaps a glimpse into what your future holds would bring comfort to your spirit. That is, may I tell you your fortune? Yes, please. You shall die. I see. Black. So much blackness. A deep dark abyss drawing you in ah it's the void you're about to inhabit now die <laughs> ow ouch Stop rolling. Ah, uh, I need a lighter weapon. Um. <laughs> Bokoblin arm. Yeah, spears are best for these guys. This guy is squirrely, yeah. Uh, my dream is bridges, so it doesn't matter whether you use Mastodon or Blue Sky AT Proto server. Yes, definitely. I big agree on that. And Zelda Dark Souls, so true. So true. We're gonna complete that shrine on our way. Um, let's switch to this. You okay there? Yeah. <laughs> Look who's here. The guy who stood around and watched me. What? You were already knocked down. What do you mean? Rude. That you were being attacked from far away. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah, I could have just left you there. I could have ran past. 
ungrateful. <laughs> hmm. That shrine's just out in the middle of the water. I kind of want to do it. Aegis Bridge. Also, did this person just sort of like drop down a little bit? Weird. Okay. I'm going to stop my horse off right here. And just float on down. I was just attacking the choo-choos. Shrine quest, watch out for the flowers. Are these flowers? They are screaming out in pain. <laughs> It's like, I didn't talk with you, lady. What, what are you talking about? Like, I flew in from the back and there were choo-choos walking all over the flowers. No. <sighs> okay. Uh, I'm going to switch to the spear because then it's more poke instead of slash. Mm-mm-mm. Must admit, um, this challenge isn't interesting. It's just kind of annoying, especially this here. Like, oh, we put a flower right in the middle of the path so that you might accidentally run onto it. Thanks, game. I appreciate it a ton. Oh yes, what inspired game design? You must avoid the flowers when you walk towards, like, if, if this shrine is like boring and they put all the challenge into just avoiding the flowers, that's going to be really disappointing. Drifting. Wow. It's Frogger. Um. <laughs> uh, also. Why do I bother with that when I can just do... Hey! Yeah, why bother with that when I can just do this? Yeah, th this challenge doesn't feel very inspired to me. Uh, 
Um, excuse me. Sorry, I had 2k unique users according to Cloudflare. Nice. Um, what was the tool about again? Uh, your account labels. I don't know what the labels in regards to Blue Sky are, but very cool that you're, uh, getting a lot of users, you know? Label checker. Yeah, yeah. No! That's not what I meant to do. Please. Nope. Uh, this button. There we go. Wow. So, so good. Ice arrows, nice. Okay. Oh, really? You can't just climb up there, huh? Very cool. Okay, and then we switch over to bomb, and then we do... Yep. Okay. <laughs> this shrine's so inspired. Drifting. <laughs> I, I don't know what this shrine was trying to get at, you know? Um, labels are part of their approach to moderation. In the future, accounts will be able to label other accounts, and you'll be able to block from seeing those accounts. Um, currently, the labels are only used internally by the team. One of them is the no promote label, which is used by the team to prevent accounts showing up in the al algorithmic feed for some reason. Interesting. Want to finish your fat thought. Valid, valid. Interesting. Spirit orb. Up to six. So that's 14 shrines? Yeah. I forget how many shrines there are in total. Uh, I don't think it's told us how many shrines there are, but I think there's eventually like you max out your um stamina and then it's like, okay, now you can only get the other thing. Can I climb up this? So many times. Class, lost count of how many times I've told you. It's just so many now. How do you not understand? Why don't you get it? I work day after day to plant those flowers. Then you come and hurt them over and over. I will make you understand? The flowers rage. Ah. Uh,
Okay. Not a death, because I'm not on zero health, but, uh... Sorry? I'll go with two of these. The shrine has changed to a pretty color. It must be pleased by my gorgeous flowers. This is annoying, and the, the puzzle wasn't that satisfying either. Probably my least favorite shrine so far. What's that over there? No, nah, that's just some debris. It's not... It, it can't be a Korok, right? Uh-oh. And of course it's raining. What's that over there? I don't know if that's another shrine, so I'm not gonna label it as such for now. Uh, I am going to assume that that is the tower that I'm heading for. Yes. That is the tower that I am heading for. Nah. Change to stamp, and we'll make that a star. Yeah, this is weird. There's a boulder on top of a pile. I need to push this. Why am I climbing it? <laughs> uh, you know what? I can do stasis. So... Stasis that. Korok. <laughs> you found me. Bye bye. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just set the rock back down. <laughs> It was right on top of your head already. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, let's take this right hand path here. Uh... deal with that. I don't know what that is, but I don't want to deal with it right now. Um, I am... You know what? Nope. Change this to that mark. I don't know what it is, but I 
don't want to deal with it. Uh, you're just a traveler. Yeah. The Yiga clan. Uh, a powerful, brave group of warriors founded by Master Kuga and dedicated to the defeating a hero thought long dead. I will take your life. Easy. Mighty banana. Uh, is anything close to breaking? I don't think so. Let's just go around the lake. We're heading towards Mount Doom. I don't think we're going to Mount Doom, but we're going around it or near it. Yeah. Oh, hey, another shrine. Change to this stand. No. <laughs> yeah. You'll see me do that a lot as I press the wrong buttons. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. I don't think my horse will swim through the water, right? Oh, it's low enough that it will just come through. Okay. Um... Yeah, I've marked that. Oh! Uh... I apparently chose the remove option. So, yeah, I didn't have any weapons equipped. <laughs> uh, this must be the land of the Zora, Zor ah, Zoras, right? I mean, it's very fish themed, if not. Um... I don't care about this town right now. I will take this bridge. <laughs> okay. Uh, you're big. You're very big. I don't want to deal with you right now. Oh my goodness. <laughs> You're, uh... Hmm? Come here. Tona. Oh my, oh wow, oh whoa. It's a Hillian, a real Hillian. Um, I mean, you are a Hillian, right? Yes, I am a Hillian. I knew it, I so knew it. Well... What are you waiting for? Go see Prince Sidon. There. 
Inogo Bridge, which is upstream of Zora River. Please listen to what dear Prince Sidon has to say. <laughs> yes, yeah, Shark Daddy, exactly. <laughs> I know it's sudden, but you'll understand everything once you get there. Trust me, you'll see. Everyone thirsts over <laughs> Sidon. <laughs> They're thirst thirsting over Ganon now. Yeah, exactly. Okay. I think I'll leave you there. Sorry, I didn't mean to bother you. <laughs> nope, I'm about to fall. Oh, I got up. Nope. Uh, ladder? Ladder. Sure. I'll take the ladder. If I, if I can. Um, is that a chameleon? The health bar kind of gives it away, you know? I don't know why I didn't start gliding right away because I had more than enough time. Yeah. Just sort of slipped over the edge. There we go. Ooh, there's a magic one over there. Nope. Hmm. I think I need to climb this one slowly. Yeah, this one seems a bit taller than some of the other ones I've gone up against. Saving. Is it the rain that's actually making it tougher to climb this? I wonder. Because I thought all these were basically copy-pasted assets, but if the rain, and it might still be, um, but if the rain affects climbing these, that's kind of interesting as well. Uh, hey there, dude. Wow, I cannot believe it. Groove? Um, excuse me. Yes, you. I am a Groove of the Zora. Uh, it is apparent that you are a traveler, but may I ask what you're doing? Uh, what brought you here? I could ask the same. Hmm, how very astute of you. An excellent query indeed. I, by the order of Prince Sidon of Zora's domain, am searching for a Hylian. Or I was, but then I fell asleep. I awoke to a loud noise and an awful quaking, and now here I am. 
I'd like to get down and be on my way, but I am simply too high up. I need to figure something out. Prince Sidon is down at the bridge below, but for some reason I cannot seem to catch his attention. But you, you are a Hillian, yes? Well then, my luck is improving. Prince Sidon, I found one. I found a Hillian. <laughs> hmm, Prince Sidon doesn't seem to notice my struggle. Perhaps I should swallow my fear and jump to the river below. Then I could return to him. He must be worried sick. Finally back. Nice. Nope. Nope. Can't do it. I'm too high up. <laughs> I'll likely meet the gods of the ever after before I ever see Prince Sidon again. Mr. Helion, I must apologize. Uh, it will be some time before I can get back to Prince Sidon. Please, you must leave me here and go on ahead. Well. Hillians are just the humans, basically, of the world, right? If that's correct, like, I don't know why they're so shocked about it, unless there's, like, humans and then Hillians, which are like look like humans but then they have the pointy ears like i don't know what the difference would be you know distilling location data has been frozen over for a very long time so true Okay, so we're going over to the temple there, it looks like. Yeah. Okay. Now to go and start identifying things. So one there. already marked that one. I don't think I marked that one, though. Yep, I did not. Did I mark that one? Yes, I did. So delete that pin. Change to that stamp. This is in the next region, but we'll still mark it. Oh, there's one right below us. <laughs> one of your favorite Zelda-based tweets? Actually, what I found most amusing is Ganon isn't being reincarnated. It's just the same guy dealing with an infinite <laughs> uh, succession of twinks. Amazing. Perfect. It's interesting that these are all like giant rib bones around here, right? Another one? <laughs> Just like, damn it again? <laughs> uh, this will be interesting. Time to go. <laughs> uh, uh, uh oh. Please. Okay. Horsey, please climb the mountain. Thank you. I'll find the Twink Factory. 
Uh, rush room. I want that. Uh, there's some rush room there, but I don't need it that bad. Just, I was close to this one. Hmm. Okay. Um, I don't know how I'm ever getting this horse down there. Uh, I think I gotta go back the other way, honestly. Please. Please. Please, horse. Horse! Muffin! Oh. Muffin, please. Don't face into the wall like that. I need to get you down. <laughs> okay, good, good. Okay, so I need to go into this city so that I can cross the proper bridge. Muffin? <laughs> Thank you. Wait, so this isn't a Zora village? Interesting. <sighs> Tatika. Oh, there's one. Here, over here. Hey, go talk with Prince Sidon. I know. Oh, hey. This is the first time I've seen one. I'm Tatika of the Zora. Aren't you a Helian? You are, aren't you? Yes, I can tell. You are most certainly a Helian. As fate would have it, our Prince Sidon is looking for a Helian like you. So I've heard the prince is at uh, Inogo Bridge right now. Will you consent to go and see him? Interesting phrasing, but yes, I'll go see him. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to. Though, I'd like to, uh, I'd kind of like you to go even if you don't want to. <laughs> hmm, yes, it is decided. You will indeed go and see the prince, even if you don't really want to. Where's the consent part then if you're going to phrase it like that, right? They look so happy. <laughs> Prince Sidon uh, is at Inogo Bridge, just over there. Are you a alien? <laughs> uh, yep. He's upstream on the Zora River, which lies to the east of here. You will find him near that tower. Alien, I am counting on you. Do you even know my name? 
I don't think I labeled that one. I did label that one. I have labeled it multiple times. <laughs> that is at least the third time that I have labeled it. <laughs> Hello there, deer and elk and everything. Hi, you're gonna be Yiga Clan, aren't you? No. Indeed. I'm a peddler, so I'm free to go anywhere the wind takes me, or the waves, or whatever, yeah. Let me introduce myself. I'm Doma. Nice to meet ya. You just spoke to that Zora over there, yeah? Yes. And that Zora told you to head towards Zora's domain to meet Prince Sidon. Is that right? Yep. That so-called Prince Sidon thing is, he ain't no good. First thing he says to me, he says, I've been watching you. And then he says, what's your name? Can you believe that heat? I don't need it. So I ran away from him and all that noise. Now here I am. So yeah. If you wanted to see a freak show, go visit that Prince Sidon. Though I doubt he'll go for you, since you're not a looker like me. Excuse me. Have you seen the number of people that thirst over Link? <laughs> Link is the looker. Like, the most femboy, you know? <laughs> uh, you know what? Ow. Oh. My shield. I can't use a shield with this weapon. That makes sense. Zalfos tail. Continues to wriggle even after being separated from its body. Kind of, uh, that kind of vitality makes it highly valued as an ingredient in elixirs. Okay then. Throwing spear. Is the fin of Hyrule. Couldn't remember Finn's name, so googled Finboy YouTuber. <laughs> I do not know who this Finn is. But if your name comes up from Femboy YouTuber. Yeah. <laughs> you there, you're a Hillian, right? A Hillian. Oh my, how wonderful. You're a Hillian. Yes. Yes, I am. I apologize for calling out to you so suddenly. Uh, Torfo of the Zora, I have been searching for a Hillian like you for a very long time. My home Zora's domain is in terrible danger. That is why Prince Sidon sent me to search for a strong Hillian warrior. Waiting at Inogo Bridge. That's Prince Sidon there. Sure. Uh, big hardy radish. Um, I'll do that, but first I'm gonna do this shrine. A Hillian! <laughs> I can't believe my eyes! It's a Hillian! Uh, stamp. Delete stamp. A Hillian! Can you believe it?
to you who sets foot in this shrine, I'm so Kofi. Minor test of strength. Okay, so this is a fighting one. Right? Ooh. I wasn't supposed to do that. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, different shield. Uh, my club broke. So let's switch to this. And then let's also get this going. Hi, Tenko. Thank you. I will stay safe. Whoa. Okay. Let's switch back to normal arrows so I don't accidentally waste those. Three ancient screws, guardian shield. It can deflect a guardian scout's beam. Good to know. Oh, I could have also thrown my bombs at it. Knight's bow. Um, lack of firing quirks makes it quite reliable. Once favored by knights at Hyrule Castle. Inventory is full. So let's... I'm gonna drop this. That just seems like the right option, you know? Boop. Your triumph over the test of strength subverts uh, a prophecy of ruin. In the ashes of Hyrule, a hero rises. Thank you for the spirit orb. Bum, ba, da, da, da. May the goddess smile upon you, and that I wither away. So basically... After today's stream, I have um, 
a Monday stream. I probably have a Tuesday stream, but that sort of depends on how the poll turns out on Twitter. But uh, I think I'll be doing Zelda two days a week based upon the results of that poll. Um, and then I need to be away for a week because of on call for work. And then when I am... Huh, this path is broken. Interesting. Okay. Um, when I'm back, I will have one stream as my fleshy self, and then I will be uh, doing VTubing stuff from then on. I'm excited. Say, hey there, young one. Up top, above you. Hello. Sidon. Print Azora Prince. When he jumped, did a thing in the background appear in front of him? Pardon the entrance. Uh, I was hoping perhaps you'd have a moment to talk. You are a Hillian, aren't you? <laughs> Aha, a Hillian. Yes, I knew it. Oh, pardon me. I am Sidon, the Zora Prince. And what is your name? Go on, please tell me. Link? Your name is Link? What a fantastic name! Hmm, though I cannot shake the feeling that I've heard it somewhere before. Well, in any case, it is a strong name. To be honest, I've been watching you. I've seen the way you work. I can tell uh, by how you carry yourself that you are no ordinary person. Link, you must be a strong warrior among the Hillians, correct? That's right. Aha, just as I suspected. I am a Zora Prince, after all. I have an eye for talent that is unparalleled. Yes, exquisite. I have been searching for someone like you for a long while. A man like you, Link, who carries himself with power. Right now, Zora's domain is in grave danger because of the massive rainfall coming from divine beast Varuta. Va Please, promise... Uh, promise you will help us. Uh, we need your strength, warrior. Won't you please come to Zoro's domain with me? Sure thing. Wow, really? Thank you, Link. You are indeed the man I thought you were. Now, Zoro's domain will be saved for certain. No time to waste. Hurry up and head over. Because of rain, the cliffs are too wet to climb. To reach the domain, you will need to go straight along this path. As a Hylian, I know you are unable to swim up the river. As such, the path to the domain may be a bit treacherous. You likely have a tough fight in store. There are monsters up ahead that attack with electricity. Don't give up. I believe in you. A little bit awkward, huh, Sid? Oh, that's right. I have something that I would like to give to you. It's just a small trinket to show that I have faith in you. Electro Elixir grants a mild level of resistance to electricity useful against enemies with electrical attacks. Hmm. It's a drink that will increase your resistance to electricity. I'm not sure why, but its effects do not seem to work for Zora, perhaps because it was made specifically for Hylians. Uh, it should work wonders for you, though. I shall go on ahead and make sure there is not anything strange coming on uh, where you are headed. I'm counting on you. Zoom. <laughs> Got the zoomies. Reach Zora's domain. Okay. So, I don't think... I can bring Muffin with me. Whoa! Unless Muffin can figure out a way up? Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm going on foot.
Nice. Shit. Can I swap back and forth between these? <laughs> Ow. Nice. Ah, I hit myself. <laughs> Give me your stuff. Silver rupee. Nice. Um. This looks like a thing that I should take a picture of. Zapshroom. Um, in the Gerudo region, cap is naturally insulated, so when used in cooking, it will offer protection against electricity. Cool. And then could probably be used for the electric elixir as well. Frog! Frog, 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 frog. Ah, uh, the frog's gone. Ow. I should do some cooking at some point. That is just like a light post of some sort. Ow. Okay. Um. Simmered fruit. Yeah. Uh, arrows, nice. A bow. Traveler's sword, sure, I'll take it. Ow. Arrow, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Leave me alone. <laughs> Is this sign a little bit menacing? These are just sort of annoying, to be honest. Yeah, I'll eat one of these. Um, I think. Um. I don't have a picture of these yet. If it has an orange border, it seems that I don't have a picture yet. Hey, Link! Sorry for calling out to you from the river. Since I am pressured, uh, since I pressured you into coming, I was not sure you would really come through. I am pleased things are going well. Ever since this strange occurrence, there have been a lot of monsters around here. Be careful as you proceed, and hurry, as... All of my fellow Zora are anxiously awaiting your arrival. Sure thing, Zora, uh, uh, Sidon. <laughs> I almost said Zora. <laughs> you, human! <laughs> Is 
Is this trying to indicate, hey, you should lever this out of place? Um, you know what? Please. Sorry, whoever that hits. <laughs> as far as I could tell, there wasn't a Korok seed thing. I do not know why that rock was there. I really do not know. Onwards we go. <laughs> okay. Just some random rocks falling. That's pretty cool. So there's a big encampment over there. Some brambles there. Okay. Uh, that sword broke, so... Let's probably use the guardian sword. Well, I think their group knows about me. Ah! This area is pretty framey. You know what? I'm just gonna run past. No, it's a blood moon for fuck's sake. <laughs> it's very red. Oh my goodness. The blood moon rises once again. Yeah, thanks, Zelda. Please be careful, Link. They use the same video clip every time, I think. Be careful, Link. That's only my second Blood Moon, but... Fuck, 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 fuck. Ah. <laughs> I know you're supposed to sneak up to them, but if you run fast enough, maybe you can catch them. <laughs> Link, over here! Sorry for calling you from so far away. The domain is still a ways off, but you're making good progress. Uh, I shall be along soon myself. I won't be much longer. In the meantime, I'll be cheering you on from here in the river, so hang in there. You can do it. Stay strong. Yeah. <laughs> we got it. <laughs> I ran past all of those enemies with their lightning bows. I'm doing so good. Mm, yeah. Ow! <laughs> I wasn't far enough away. And I think all my spoils fell into the river. Unfortunate. Okay. Maybe I should have hit it with the hammer. Um... Uh, 
It, it, okay, it's an electric keys. Ow! Making you drop the weapon you're holding. Okay. Oh, shoot. I am very low on health. Yeah, I definitely need to cook soon. Um, Let's go ahead and use this. Uh oh. Uh, ba ba. Oh, crap. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Another death. Continue. After pressing continue, it waits a considerable amount of time. Okay. Uh, maybe at this point is when I... Yeah. Here, I, I can fix this. Okay, it was just some rock salt. But, I should probably take this at this point. I should have looked at that recipe. Um... Oh! It's only one thing at a time. Cool. Great. I love it. That mechanic was definitely explained to me super well. It's going to wake all these up, isn't it? Oh! Just go. Um, this, eat. Okay. And then I should equip this, and I should equip probably that. You know what? Uh, excuse me. Those were supposed to be bomb arrows, not normal arrows. I expected it to explode. I'm glad that did not explode. <laughs> but why aren't the bomb arrows going? Is it because it's raining? It must be because it's raining, right? 
like it's kind of cool but it's also just really annoying that like oh i expect this to explode and it does not Or in bridge. Sidon? Hey, Link! You're almost halfway to Zora's domain. Uh, oh, by the way, there are a few spots up ahead with lots of enemies, but I'm sure you will be fine. I believe in you, Link. I'm definitely well prepared for this situation. Um, yum, 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 yum. Turn the other way. Yes, you're eating fish. I get it. dead okay cooking spot I should do some cooking um okay uh let's do a simple like fruit stew Then hold. These are really simple, just being like three apples equals three hearts. Uh, maybe I should make a couple two heart ones. Let's make one like this, which I'm going to use immediately. And then I'm going to make a couple of sets of two. cold, arid regions. Hold. Meat. And rock salt. Like a sweet and salty dish? Okay. <laughs> um Is this enough food for now? Maybe? Honestly, I should be picking up more apples probably. Like, whenever I see the apples, just go for them. Mm. 
Okay. Nothing with that. Oh. Hey there, Flint. Sometimes I just push the things because I expect a Korok to appear. But then it's not the case. <laughs> hmm. I pressed the take button, but it would not let me take. I should not have come down here. <laughs> I like that the plants look like coral. How close am I? Almost to Ruto Mountain. You know what? I'll I'll go ahead and attack you. Azora's spear. This spear is Azora's weapon of choice. It's lighter than it looks, due it uh, being made from a special metal, and is used by the Zora for both fishing and protecting their domain. Lizal spear. Um. Nothing super interesting there. Okay. So we'll probably make it to Zora Domain and then that'll be it for today's stream. I still have like an hour left, but I'm just trying to be realistic. We might be able to do some stuff, you know? Ooh, what's this? Um, and then we switch to hammer. Badly damaged. Unfortunate. Am I supposed to be going down below? Oh well, this is the way I'm going. <laughs> History of the Zora Part 2. Where's Part 1? Once every 10 years, the Laneru region experiences unusual heavy rainfall. The Zora River flooded every time. The tides damaged not only our domain, but our people, washing away poor souls and causing great suffering and disarray. The Zora King of that time, after seeking aid from the King of Hyrule, rode out to see what could be done. By joining the architectural genius of the Zora and the Hyrule's technological prowess, East Reservoir Lake was swiftly built. Thanks to the fruitful partnership, Hyrule was no longer plagued by these devastating floods. Uh, in gratitude, the Zora King promised uh, the King of Hyrule to manage the reservoir level to protect all of Hyrule from floods. Each Zora King since has kept that oath, spanning 10,000 years. That is why the reservoir signifies our bond with Hyrule. Cool. I'd love to know where the first of these plaques are because I completely missed it. I'm supposed to be down there. <laughs> okay. I, I don't know how I ended up up here. No. Shit. Oh, well. Um, 
Yeah, we'll equip this one for now. This looks like a bombable spot. It is not a bombable spot. Wait. Okay, never mind. I knew this the whole time. I knew I was going the wrong way, or I was going the right way. <laughs> hey, look, those rocks are falling again. <laughs> never would have expected that, to be honest. And the big rock never would have expected that either. Here's part one. Okay. Um, I'm not supposed to be using this weapon. Boomerang. Okay. History of the Zora Part 1, the eternal Zora's domain, as told by King uh, Dorfan. Uh, the rains have blessed Lin Lineru since ancient times with an abundance of pure, clean water. Seeking a bounty of such water, the Zora gathered there. Thus, as the legends go, the domain was born 10,000 years ago. The land was also rich in ore, and so a unique form of stonemasonry was developed to create our new home. The domain is... One giant sculpture, a feat of architecture that has drawn admirers the world over. Our great domain has ever, uh, will ever stand as a hallmark of the esteemed artists who made it, an internal symbol of Zora pride. Okay. I see y'all. Ah. No. Ah. No. Um. No, get out of the water. all bow okay why'd I come up here Please, game. Let me jump up here. Forked boomerang. Like this weapon, uh, it has one more blade than the Lizal boomerang to give it an additional cutting power. Still returns when thrown. Interesting. So I should probably then drop this and pick that up so 
Silver rupee, very nice. More shield. Can never have too many shield. Um, I won't go this way for now. Ow. I will instead just float over here. Sometimes there's amber. So there's many reasons to pick up the rocks. Luluto's Crossing. Lots of ore down there. Hey, Link! Hello, Sidon. Look below down here. You're way down there. This tune, every time. You're still pretty far off, my friend. But I was sure you'd be passing over this bridge, so I've, I, I have been waiting for you. Uh, you will be in Zora's domain before you know it. In fact, I'm going to head that way too. I shall meet you there. Whoa, Link, beware, warrior. A monster approaches from behind you. Uh, okay. Well. Uh. Nope. Um. No. Ah, no! Ah, uh, this is worse than dying, honestly. Oh, I died. Okay. <laughs> When's my last save, though? How far back am I? Oh, hi there. Nice. Goodbye, club. Moblin Fang. It's too hard to be reshaped into a tool, but it can be tossed into a stew with some critters uh, to create elixirs. Uh, it can, can't be used in normal food recipes, but it does have some use as an ingredient in making elixirs. What does my shirt provide again? Um. Oh, it reveals their life gauge. Yeah, that's pretty important. <laughs> Uh, excuse me. I tried to pick it up. Why is it, like, gearing me up? <laughs> hey, here's a bunch of food stuff. No, seems a little sus. <laughs> oh my goodness, sus wouldn't have been a thing when Breath of the Wild first came out. This came out in 2017 and... Like, I think for... AV... It might it might have already been a thing. I'm not certain on that. But definitely um, wasn't, like, in the common vernacular with Among Us, you know? How many 
bird drumstick do I have? 14? I should probably just cook those up. Uh, forked Lizal spear. Mighty cart. Temporarily increase your attack power. Oh, great. Yep. Um, let's get some food. Um, and then I think I should probably equip this. No, shit. Oh, great. I don't know where I put that boomerang at. You know what? I'm just running. I'm just getting out of here. What? I... Okay. Sure. Whatever. That's fine. You know what? No, just run. I'll read this real quick. Addendum 1. Uh, King Dorfin stands his ground. Around 100 years after King Dorfin ascended to the th throne, a stray guardian crossed upland Zoran, Zorana into our domain. The guardian seemed unstoppable. Our best soldier's spears barely left a scratch on its metal hull. It was then that our King Dorfan, without a thought for his own safety, came out to face the Guardian himself. With supernatural strength, he lifted the Guardian and hurled it into a ravine. The impact of the fall left the Guardian in pieces and was never to trouble another Zora ever again. The citizens celebrated the King's valor. From then on, their trust and respect for him grew beyond compare. Uh, you can still see the scar he earned that day on his forehead, a token of his triumph. Okay, and now we run. Um, this is an English stream, so I don't know what this text says. Uh, translate. Okay, so translated... It says, so the translated message says, Hi, I'm the black man from the factory, and I'm hiding with Noki Man, the professor, my cat, and Jake. Sure? I, I'm sorry, I, I don't know how to respond to that, really. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. <laughs> I'm going to leave the message because it doesn't seem like that bad. But also, I, I just don't understand. Okay, guess I got to open up Google Translate again. This probably isn't translating correctly. 
can't believe that Finn, like F-I-N, has been captured by the Z and uh, Tomulapus? I, like, I, I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, your other way, uh, this is an English stream. Please only message in English. And then I'm going to copy this message and paste that there. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it seems very off topic. <laughs> Like, I, 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 I don't know how to respond to that message. Ah, frog. Okay. <laughs> like, either Google Translate is really poorly translating it, which could definitely be the case. Like, translation tools aren't perfect, but it's usually not that bad, you know? It's usually somewhat on track, but not accurate, you know? Bye bye. Ooh. Um. I think that's our first look at the Divine Beast. I can probably just skip ahead a bit, right? Yeah, no reason to walk the full distance. I'll go ahead and drop onto... Wait, hold on. Okay, good. I am going the correct direction. Uh, let's read this sign. History of the Zora, Part 7. The hero who defeated the lie something, as told by King Dorfin. Uh, there was a time when the people of the land were threatened by the divine beast something who lived on something mountain. But only one Hillian drove the beast back and restored peace to the domain. The Zora Helm one in this fight is not north of is now north of the something in the something near the something lake it rests there to honor the deeds of the hero link okay so there's a zora helmet north of a lake. This is the reservoir. It's probably in the Veiled Falls. Right? Some four characters lake. Ruto Lake. North of Ruto Lake. It, it has to be in Veiled Falls, right? Change to stamp. I want to explore that. <laughs> nope. Frog, 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 frog. Ah, okay. <laughs> Every time I see a frog, it's just going to be that. Frog, frog, frog. <laughs> Woodcutter's axe. Hmm. I kind of want that. 
Uh, we'll drop one of these spears for it. Okay, we got about a half hour left. Zora's Domain. Zora's Domain is really pretty. Sidon, hello. Whoa. Hello. <laughs> I've been waiting for you, Link. Welcome. Behold the pride of my people, Zora's Domain. Now I shall introduce you to the king. Hurry this way. Okay. <laughs> Throne room on the top floor. Is that a shrine? They built their whole place around a shrine? Well, I'm gonna go do the shrine. Nizyoma Shrine. I know it's not the main quest, but I want to do this, you know? <laughs> Pushing power. Hmm. Okay. Um... That was close. Okay. I am up here now. Was there a better way to get up here? I don't know. But that's how I chose to get up here. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look like you could have gone from there. Okay. So... Zora's spear, which I already have. Is there, you know what? I should drop. Probably not gonna use this one. Let's grab the Zora spear. Okay. So. It, shifting. Okay. Um. Um.
No. Okay. Ah, oh, please. Fine game. Fine. Fine. You. You forced my hand. <laughs> Made me walk all the way back up here. How dare you? <laughs> okay. So. As far as I can tell, the first thing that needs to happen is that. And then that. Which is gonna toss it over the end. Okay. So... I want to have... Something like that. And something like that. Um, here, let's push this one out of the way. Um, can I break that one safely? Seems I can. Okay. Um, I want to put this, like, here? Then put that there to prevent it rolling around that way. Um. Please don't be too far. Okay. go ahead and shatter that one as well. Um. Hopefully that's enough. Worst case, I'll course correct with this, right? Okay, cool. Cool. Just had like a little bit of awkwardness, so you had to catch it and stuff, you know? Blink. Your resourcefulness is, uh, in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. Bestow upon you this spirit orb. Ba -da -da -da. May the goddess smile upon you and then withers away.
Okay. Anything in- Ooh. Uh, sure, I'll take a picture of this. Fleet Lotus Seed. Sure. Bearsley Seeds grows near deep water. The roots draw nutrients from the water, which boosts your movement speed when the seeds are cooked into a dish. Alrighty. A uh, big sword. For spears to swords, they made this two-handed weapon using a special metal. Uh, it found popularity among Hillians for its unique design. Uh, well. I gotta try this out. Um. You know what? We've been using this spirit. Let's drop it and pick up this. It's a two-handed sword. Um. We'll use the Zora Spear for now. <laughs> Bright-eyed crab. And you'll forget all your exhaustion. Interesting. Okay. Cool. Good evening. Are you a Helian? That's right. Where are my manners? I'm Laflet. Uh, I'm the chief secretary for the royal family. Are you curious about the statue of Lady Mifa? Yes, I'm curious. If you do not mind, please allow me to explain. This is the statue of the former Zora champion. Her name was Lady Mifa. She was, uh, she was as kind as she was beautiful. They say her ability to heal wounded soldiers was beyond compare. Those soldiers she healed, they are old and decrepit now, but they remember. For this reason, the elders of the domain all love Lady Mifa dearly. Uh, if you would like to know more, I suggest you try talking to one of them. Okay. Hi. Hi. Maro Mart. This is where you'll find our general store, the Coral Reef. Our workshop, the Hammerhead, is also here. Okay. Um, okay. Hey, Goron. Hello there. Uh, please let me talk with you. Rega. Hey, you're Helian, aren't you? It's rare to see your kind around here. As for me, I was roaming nearby during my travels when Prince Sidon recruited me and brought me here. That's because I can touch shock arrows, but I also weigh, well, a lot. There's no way I'll be able to carry you on my back. That's what Prince Sidon said to me. It was kind of rude of him, wasn't it? Dento, you seem very tired. So the Hylian who stole Lady Mifa away thinks he can just come wandering in here like nothing happened. What business do you have here after all these years? What is this place? The weapons workshop. What are you doing? Trident maintenance. A trident? The light scale trident and the ceremonial trident. You have been making rackets since you walked in here. There is no point in coming here if you do not possess the light scale trident. Leave. Now. All right. Goodbye. Leave now. <laughs> uh, hey, crab. Sure. <laughs> um, oh, that, that's where I was supposed to go up. But there's also a crab there. This game has so much popping. Shock arrow. Hey! Who did it? You stole my shock arrows? You, your Link! Finally, I can avenge Lady Mifa. It has been a hundred years since you last showed your face around here. Now I, Sagan, will cut you down myself. 
What do you mean? Plain dumb, eh? Nice try, but you cannot fool me, Champion Link. Uh, you were unable to protect Lady Mifa from Calamity Ganon. It has been a hundred years since we lost her. Poor Lady Mifa. How heartbreaking. I won't fail her, her, fail her again. Ah, of course. But you stole my shock arrow. That's why. In it, uh, in that case, you take the responsibility of appealing, uh, appeasing the divine beast Va Ruta. Uh, yep, that, that was planned. <laughs> hmm. So the younger generation are like, who's this dude? And then the older generation is like, fuck you, Link. <laughs> So, uh, this is gonna be interesting. Well, well, it's always nice to have a visitor here. Thank you for join uh, journeying to our fair Zora's domain. Wait a moment. You, you're Link. The perpetrator who forced Lady Bifa to join his crusade a hundred years ago, only to be destroyed by Calamity Ganon. As though I could ever forget that face. You should know that the elderly here, who loved Lady Mifa, still remember, and they still resent you. I, however, resent the deed and not the person. I also believe in allowing the mistakes of the past to wash away. Link. I have retired from my role as a priest. I am now living my life free from the material concerns of this world. However, ever since I retired, each day is more boring than the last. Spending day after day in idleness, only to pass from this world soon. Link. As I'm sure you are well aware, the afterlife lays claim to all. We never know when it will beckon. If during your travels you meet any engaged couples, I would like you to introduce them to me. Joining two souls is a true honor, one I shall stake my life on. Just one more wedding and I shall be fulfilled. Okay. Interesting side quest. Okay, I think that's all the sneaky river snails. Hello and welcome. Zora's Domain is currently searching for a Hillian like you. That said, this Hillian, I get the feeling I've seen him before. Perhaps a long time ago. Yeah, this meeting with the king isn't going to go well. Hello there, King Dorfin. That one does not like me. Ah, you must be the Hillian that Sidon brought here, correct? You did well to come all the way here. I am King Dorfin, ruler of the Zora. You are very big, sir. Hmm? The object upon your waist. Is that not a chic slate? Hmm? Now that I've gotten a good look at you, it is all too clear who you are. You are the champ Hillian champion, Link. I don't know what it is, but it seems that Link and, like, all the things on Link have, like, a slight positional, like, jitter. As if, um, some sort of floating point, like, rounding error, you know, where, where... Like, certain games, if they use, like, a float instead of a double, and it causes, like, things to jitter a little bit. It seems something like that, right? <laughs> Do not tell me you have forgotten me. The Hillian Champion? You can't mean THE Link. That Champion. Uh, so that's why I have heard your name before. What a fateful coincidence that we should cross paths. I cannot believe it. The Hillian Champion, Link, has appeared before us. We have met numerous times, I'll have you know. Ah, so many memories. My mind is overflowing with nostalgia, my friend. I had heard a terrible rumor that you had fallen in combat, but it appears you managed to survive. Extraordinary. Uh, I've been sleeping. I lost my memory. Come again? You say you have lost your memories? Uh, your memory. But surely you must remember my precious daughter, Mifa. Yes, you do. Do you not? 
both of these are bad. Both of these are really bad. Who the hell are you? Wait a minute. Who are you? That that uh, a vine of the <laughs> little blonde kid <laughs> from some TV program. Well, I know Mifa from the statue out there, but like I don't know Mifa. Mifa who? I cannot believe it. Have you truly forgotten my dear Mifa as well? I don't know shit, dude. <laughs> I don't know anything. You and Mifa were so close, yet you do not remember her? Young hero, please look upon the beauty of the Zora's domain. Do you see that statue? Does gazing upon Mifa's immortalized form still not jog your memory? Well, perhaps your memory will return in time. I hope so. I dearly hope so. Father, I do not believe discussing my sister is helping matters at the moment. Link seems confused. So, Sidon is the potentially younger brother of Mifa? It sounds like. Oh, yes, of course. But first, it's worth noting how remarkable it is that Sidon brought a champion here without realizing it. That is quite a feat, my boy. <laughs> that is a good one. Link, I doubt not that you have endured a great many trials. Still, I must ask you to hear my plea. Now then, hero, must inform you that Zoro's domain is in danger of vanishing because of divine beast Varuta. I shall do you the courtesy of speaking bluntly. We cannot stop this beast. Will you lend us your strength? Sure. What? King Dorfin, my liege, please do not speak so. To ask a Hillian for help? Why, the very thought of it curls my fins. Muzu, I expect more of, expected more of you. How can you still protest? Muzu, it is rude to speak that way to your king and his guest. Link is here because I invited him. With such unprecedented rainfall, we have no choice but to rely on the aid of a trustworthy Hillian. Have we not already discussed this and arrived at that very conclusion? He's the key to saving the Zora's domain. I have no doubt in my mind. Indeed, Link is a champion through and through. As things now stand, Zora's domain, nay, perhaps all of Hyrule, is doomed to be swallowed by the sea. This is bigger than all of us, my friends. Zoras and Helians alike must put aside our differences and band together. Have you forgotten already, my king? We cannot trust these lowly Helians. A hundred years ago, they abused the power of an ancient civilization and turned Hyrule into what it is today. And that is not the least of it. It is their fault that Lady Mipha was lost to us. Link? Divine Beast Varuta has great power. It has the unique ability to create an endless supply of water. Of late, it has been mercilessly spouting water into the air. As a result, this area has been plagued by heavy rains. For us, Zora, water and air are as one. So the world would not... Uh, so, so you would think... Wow. Let me start that sentence over. For us, Zora, water and air are as one, so you would not think this would be quite so critical of a problem. Sadly, the rains have filled the eastern reservoir nearly to the point of flooding. If the reservoir bursts, as it soon will, I fear immense damage will befall not only Zora's domain, but also the area downstream from us. There, Hillian lives are in very grave danger. Hmm. The Divine Beast is crying out once again. Had a nice little controller shake there, too. It's an elephant. <laughs> Who 
<laughs> it's a giraffe. <laughs> SpongeBob. Um, the Divine Beast Varuta. Your Princess Zelda often studied the Divine Beast. That is, in the time before the Great Calamity. Uh, according to her research, the orbs located on Ruta's shoulders are mechanisms that control the water it generates. However, they require electricity to work. These orbs are clear, clearly out of control now because there is no electricity coursing through uh, to stop them. Zagan, who is quite shock resistant for Azora, hit one with a shock arrow. Sure enough, it slowed the water a bit. Unfortunately, as an aquatic race, we Zora are terribly vulnerable to the power of electricity. Perhaps because uh, we could not safely strike it with enough electricity at once, the water soon returned to its full force. That is why I went in search of a Hylian who could help us. Link, I am certain you have already figured this out, but we need you to use shock arrows to get those orbs working properly again. I will aid you in any way I can, of course. Please, hero, I beg you, help me stop Ruta's rampage of destruction. I, um... What? Princess Zelda herself instructed you to board the Divine Beast and appease it from within? So then, Princess Zelda is still alive? Yes. In Hyrule Castle. I do not believe it. She was alive this whole time, just as you were. The events of a hundred years ago cannot be altered. It, it is true. But we can regain control of the Divine Beast. They may yet prove useful in sealing Calamity Ganon once and for all. I did not know you had such grand ambitions, Link. Wondrous. Naturally, I shall help too. Once I am, once it has stopped rampaging, you can easily climb inside it. Come, Link. Uh, let us appease Ruta together. I am in. Let's do this. Thank you, Link. Truly, we are in your debt. Our goal is the same. That means our meeting was nothing short of destiny. Now then, allow me to offer you this gift as a show of faith. Zora armor. Uh, custom armor painstakingly crafted by each generation's Zora princess for her future husband. Wearing it will give you the ability to swim up waterfalls. So long as you wear this, you can ascend waterfalls just like a Zora. Please take good care of it. King Zorafen, surely you do not really intend to give this outsider the Zora armor. Countless generations of Zora princesses have gifted that armor to the one they have sworn to marry. Princess Mifa made that one there with her own hands. It is far too important to entrust to a shady Helian. He may be a champion, but Mifa had no such relationship with him. So why should he receive such an honor? This is just too much, my liege. I do not understand it one bit. <laughs> Huh. That Muzu is not easily swayed once his mind is set. You must understand, he was in charge of educating my dear Mifa, my dear daughter Mifa. Naturally, she means a lot to him, just as she means the world to us. Ever since we lost her to the Calamity, he has grown to despise Helians. I hope you can forgive his rudeness. Hmm, what shall we do now? I tasked Muzu with finding the shock arrows we need to appease Varuta, but now he has rushed off in a huff. Uh, Link, do not let his words concern you. I shall work this out with Muzu. I shall return shortly. Okay, Sidon, I trust you. Goodbye, Sidon. Uh, Sidon, I suppose that means you are going to tell him. Link, Muzu is most likely at the square down below. Would you mind going down there? I would like you to try to speak with him. Okay. Ooh, princess statue. Or, or a goddess statue. Uh, stamina vessel? And I'll probably just do another stamina wheel. Yeah, let's do another stamina vessel. 
Mm. Yeah, let's do the stamina vessel. care what you say. Muzu, please listen. <clears throat> Hello! Hmm. You came all the way here, but it was in vain. I have no desire to speak with you. Listen well, Muzu. There is something you need to know. He who stands here, the man called Link, is the one whom my sister, Mifa, had feelings for. I was only a child then, so I did not know it myself at the time, but it is so. I grew up hearing my father tell stories, some of which were about my sister's undying love for a Hillian named Link. What? No! You cannot fool me with such a fanciful lie, not this Zora. How could Lady Mifa possibly have feelings for a Hillian like him? The facts are clear. He remembers nothing, even when he looks upon Princess Mifa's statue. It is truth, Muzu. Though you never knew it, he was ever in Mifa's heart. <clears throat> A memory is returning. Yep. Hello, Mita. I was thinking. This reminds me of the first time we met. Of the time we first met. You were just a reckless child. Always getting yourself hurt at every turn. Every time, I would heal you. Just as I'm doing right now. I thought it was funny how, being a Hillian... You looked grown up so uh you look grown up so much faster than I did. I was I was always willing to heal your wounds. Even back then. Did I read that right? It didn't feel right, but whatever. So if this calamity, calamity Ganon does in fact return, what can we really do? We just don't seem uh, to know much about what we'll be up against. But know this, no matter how much this battle might get, how difficult this battle might get, uh, if you, if anyone ever tries to do you any harm, then I will heal you. No matter when or how bad the wound, I hope you know that I will always protect you. Once this whole thing is over, Maybe things can go back to how they used to be when we were young. You know. Perhaps we could spend some time together. <gasps> what is the matter, Link? Are you unwell? Hmm? <laughs> You're quivering like a hatchling. What's the matter? Mifa, I remember. Oh, how convenient. <laughs> what? Do not mistake me for a fool, Helion. There is no way you remembered her just now when it is a most convenient. In any case, without any solid proof, I cannot possibly take you at your word. If you have any such proof, now is the time to show it. Do so, and, and I... I shall tell you how to get those shock arrows. Yes, as well as anything else you wish to know. Okay.
We have the Zora armor that perhaps it will be proof enough? Muzu, look closely at the clothes Link is wearing. Hmm. Huh? You really think changing your clothes is going to make me... Eh? What in the... That is the Zora armor from before. Lady Mifa made that by hand, and yet it fits you perfectly? What is the meaning of this? Now you understand, do you not? Now you know who her heart belonged to and who she made this, this special armor for. The fact that this armor fits Link perfectly should be proof enough that Mifa made it for him and him alone. You have always disliked Hillians, even before the Great Calamity. That is why Mifa never told you. Now that you know, you must promise to help him save us all, Muzu. Please, tell us where we can find the shock arrows we need. Knowing you, I bet you have already figured it out. Hmm. I never would have imagined she would make that special armor for one such as he. I do not approve of asking for help from a Hylian, but I suppose it is our only option at this point. I am a proud Zora. That means I want I must take responsibility for my unwarranted behavior towards you. As promised, I shall tell you where you can collect as many shock arrows as you will need. That tall mo mountain over yonder. Uh, it's called Ploymus Mountain. Uh, and there you will also find Shatterback Point. A terrifying creature has made its home up there. This awful beast shoots volley after volley of shock arrows. Even a single one could be fatal to Azora. Aha! You must mean that Alino. He's a man beast, that one. That beast does indeed wield shock arrows. That is certainly one way to collect them quickly. He is vicious to be sure, but I am certain Link will rise to the challenge. In order to appease the divine beast, I estimate that you will need hmm, at least 20 shock arrows. Do you think you can gather that many? Why do you still doubt him, Muzu? Uh, I have no doubt he will be triumphant. Okay, Link, let's get moving. The fastest way to Ploymus Mountain is to ascend the waterfall east of the domain. That Zora armor should come in handy. Just swim to the waterfall basin and then go up the waterfall from there. Okay. <clears throat> I'll wait at East Reservoir Lake, right by the Divine Beast. Gather at least 20 shock arrows, then come join me. I'm on it. Wonderful! Together we shall stop the Divine Beast's onslaught. Okay. And that is where we're going to wrap up for today. Thank you all so much for joining. I hope you enjoyed the stream. I'm having a great time with Zelda. I, I'm, I'm looking forward to playing a lot more, you know. <laughs> um, based upon the current results of the poll, uh... So I, I have two polls up. One is for what should I do for Tuesdays? Do I stream more Breath of the Wild or do I just uh, switch to three days a week instead of four days a week for streaming? So um, right now that poll says uh, we'll be doing Breath of the Wild going forward. Uh, and I'm totally down for that. I'm, I'm loving Breath of the Wild and I'm excited to play more. Um, as far as the other poll, that is for what I'm going to be playing on my debut stream. Um, that's going to be an eight hour stream and it's going to be, uh, either Breath of the Wild, Dredge, like the first half-ish of Dredge, uh, or, um, I'm going to be playing four different games of Slay the Spire, uh, Peglin, uh, Wild Frost, and some Super Auto Pets. Uh, if we have interest in the viewer like lobby, uh, I'll, I'll be hosting viewer lobbies to, to allow people to uh, join in and play together, you know? So that, that's the second Twitter poll I have going. So yeah, um, see y'all tomorrow for some Divinity Original Sin 2. 
uh, and then maybe see you all on Tuesday for some more Breath of the Wild. Take care, everyone. I will see you all next time. Bye-bye, friends.